Hello Leo, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. And Leo, today we are going to find out who is your next serious love for those who are single and curious. Spirits and angels, please show me Leo's next serious love. Who is Leo's next serious love? Wow, okay. Queen of Swords and a King of Swords here, okay, maybe, um, I feel like this will be a true match, okay, Leo, somebody whom you may meet at work, I feel, or some sort of, through some sort of a communication here with the Swords, um, also, I feel like this is somebody very serious, very blunt, okay, with the Nine of Swords here in reverse as well. They don't think twice before they speak because they're just honest. Somebody very honest, very blunt, and they'll lay their cards out right away and tell you who they are or what they expect. And with the Seven of Wands in reverse as well, somebody who doesn't have their guards up. I feel like the guards are up, but I feel like it has more to do with what they say. They say what they think. Very intelligent as well. Can be very strategic. And this can also be an arrangement. Um, if both of you are together, it's like a win-win situation. Both of you benefit uh, each other in, in some way, shape or form, okay? And we've got the high persist, yeah, high persist in my Somebody who is very transparent, doesn't hide any secrets. They just tell you everything. And um, can be an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, can be a Pisces, can be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, okay? And this is somebody with the Six of Pentacles, whom is very kind, I would say. They do charity or, you know, they, they donate money or mm, very generous, Six of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody very, very generous. Uh, you may meet this person again at work or when you're doing some charity or again through some sort of communication um seven of pentacles in reverse yeah this this person waits for nobody waits for nobody they are so strict and they they can just cut people off just like that without any qualms and they don't have a i, I won't I feel like they don't, they're not old fashioned, okay? They're very, very modern in the way they think. Um, they're not like, they don't follow the norm. That's what I'm sensing with the hangman in reverse. They see things in very, very different perspective. Um, they don't follow the crowd as well. They do their own thing. It looks like they are very independent, may own their business or, you know, have a job or a role that is quite high up there, okay? Can be a manager or own their own businesses as well. Let's see more. Yeah, definitely not somebody old fashioned. Um, they're not gonna just give to anybody. They're very selective. With Empress in reverse. Um, may not like to do house chores or you know, more like a business mind. A very very modern kind of a. Uh, uh, person here that i'm seeing and yeah they wait for nobody and queen of wands in reverse it's to them it's all about i wouldn't say that they are unable to love they can seem kind of cold okay cold but because we got the queen of wands in reverse and the empress in reverse so they can seem kind of cold but i feel like maybe it's because in the past may, maybe they've experienced some hardships because usually the queen of uh, swords she appears after she's been through a lot very very experienced right through the experiences is when uh, they grow into somebody who may be a little bit uptight <laughs> or they have their boundaries they don't like people to cross so yeah to them chemistry and you know uh, physical intimacy is not it's not i wouldn't say it's not important at all but that's not like 
um, their priority. Their priority is like with choosing their partner or doing things in a logical and practical way. Okay, but there's some fun side about them as well. Page of Cups for some of them, um, they could even have a child. Okay, uh, they could some of them only they may have a child who is a bit. Well, can be whatever age, but Page of Cups, sometimes I see this as a teenage child. You know, maybe even 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 years old or older as well, okay? Because sometimes the Queen of Swords can be a uh, somebody who was married before, and but divorced. So most likely they have a child, okay? Some of them, not all of them. But if Page of Cups is actually them, I just saw 555 Leo. If you guys would like to check out your angel number 555, uh, you can just go ahead and Google it. If they don't have a child, Page of Cups could just mean that that's, a, uh, that's one side of their personality that is very fun as well, okay? They may do unexpected things, um, being very spontaneous as well. Oh, that this person may be somebody you did not expect to be with. Um, or someone whom is not your usual type, okay? The Fool is in reverse, Two of Cups in reverse, Five of Cups in reverse. Okay, this is definitely somebody who doesn't like to be fooled, being lied to. Um, they take calculated risks. And Two of Cups in reverse, yeah, it's not all about love, 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 Leo. <laughs> I feel like this person is going to be somebody whom is very strategic, very, um, I would say loyal as well, very straightforward, they don't filter their words, and also very logical and practical, okay, even when it comes to love. When it comes to love, I feel like they're going to start small, though, Page of Cups is small, and they're going to do unexpected things, they're open to being, you know, uh, impromptu okay especially when it comes to adventures maybe some traveling as well maybe they like traveling five of cups in reverse yeah i would say that they're mostly a positive person or that they try to be very positive um because you know two of five of cups with it, with it being reversed so they try to see the glass half full then it is half empty eight of cups here you may have to i i feel like it's not going to be a, a relationship that is going to happen very quickly, okay? It might take a while before this happens, this connection happens, if you allow it to, okay? This is somebody whom could have already moved from a different place. I feel like this can be a different race, this person or somebody whom moves to your country or you move to, to their country, something like that. Or maybe both of you uh, met each other will meet each other while you are traveling. All right, Leo, this is your reading. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I hope to see you tomorrow at your next reading. I'm going to leave you with a few videos on screen. The latest one would be a prediction reading. Uh, if you'd like to find out if there is a chance of you and a past person in reconciling, um, that's that video is going to be on my second vlog channel. All right, uh, if you're interested. If not, Leo, I hope to see you tomorrow at your next reading. Take care. Bye.